Hey guys, this is Chase with Idaho Hockey. I'm here, a product manager at Skates for CCM Hockey, J.S. Boulanger. Now we're hanging out in Montreal and we have your three families of skates in front of us. So maybe for that player who's never been in a CCM, but that wants to hop into one, especially now with these three fits, uh, how would you describe the differences in fit profile as well as maybe what foot fits best in each? Sure, so if we start with our newest skate, that being the JetSpeed FT1, um, we call that our tapered fit and uh, that is suited for a player that has uh, a, 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 maybe a little bit more of a tight heel, uh, a player who has a, maybe a more slender forefoot. So it's slightly more narrow than um, the, the previous generation of skates that we had, that being in the SuperTax line. Uh, and it's really suited for that player that wants to have an absolute connection to uh, the skate's zero negative space. Um, and then when we talk about the, the instep measurement, usually we're talking about a low to medium measurement. So, um, you know, a good, a large number of players are able to fit very, very well into the FT1. And so you probably categorize that as like a low, maybe a low medium right. volume. Okay. And then, so I guess moving to the medium volume skate, but yep. still with that awesome one piece construction, can exactly. you hit on the super tax as well? Absolutely. So that one's a little bit more of a generous skate. Um, when you, you picture the fact that we have, of course, in, in all of our lines, a D and a double E width skate. Um, this is the skate line that'll allow you to get that player that has a little bit more of a, of a high volume foot. Mm -hmm. um, so with the, uh, with the super tax line, you still have that one piece skate in the, in the high end version, um, but with a little bit more space when it comes comes to the forefoot and uh, a nice anatomical heel lock when it comes to uh, the back of the skate really locks your, your heel nicely but it gives you a little bit more space than what the FT1 had so you've got basically two chances to be properly fit in a one-piece skate with the jet speed line and the super tax line. And then if you're looking for a little more traditional fit and feel uh, you could probably hop over into this 50k so right. what, how would you describe the overall fit of this? Right so the the 50k uh, we look at this as, as one of the more flexible constructions it's not quite as stiff as the super high-end composite materials that we use in the super tax and the ft1 and that's intentional this is what pro players have asked us for they wanted a different option one that's a little bit more flexible and has a more of a i guess a catch-all um, characteristic when it comes to fitting players we also have the 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 legendary pump technology on there uh, which is a, a custom feature it allows you to customize how you want your heel to fit inside the skate. So really when we talk about a catch-all, that's exactly what we mean. We're talking about a, a skate that has um, perhaps more of a, uh, of a narrow characteristic, mm -hmm. however very flexible, so it's very adaptable. So if you have a more slender foot, you'll fit in it, and then if you have a wider foot, you'll be able to adapt the materials to the skate in, in order to adapt the materials to your foot. I should say, and the uh -huh. skate will fit very, very well. Gotcha, and then maybe if you just had to name one player that's using each of these in the NHL, how would you go through the line? Sure, uh, well, the, the, the jet speed line is extremely popular. Uh, we've got Nathan McKinnon wearing the FT1 version right now, yep. uh, and of course, Connor McDavid use, using the jet speed family, so very, very fast players. Super tax guys like John Tavares, um, the, it, Patrice Bergeron guys who are uh, you know, very powerful skaters, mm -hmm. and then the, the Ribcore 50K guys who are a little bit more traditional. You think of Sidney Crosby, yep. um, he's, he's a guy who loves the 50K skate. Awesome. Well, JS, thank you for your time out here. I really appreciate it. And then for you guys at home that would check out more of these CCM skates, make sure you go to icewarehouse.com.